So the October event is running and it's a good way to make some money by selling the item lots and getting 100 easy boss points. And here is how you do that. So let's go. To be a blackjack. Play now and win many Tibia coins. Blackjack. Roll lag. Crash game. And high low. Plus the chance of winning 250 Tibia coins every week. All provably fair games. Link on the description. So this event lasts for one week and it comes around twice a year. And the rewards are mostly plushies. There are also some mounts that can be looted and a boss which you can do. The access to the boss is really easy. You have to find the great Snitchel. I usually ask someone who has the all-knowing sausage that can be bought for 100 festival points. That item can tell you the location of the Snitchel. Find the town, enter the cauldron and kill the hams. Loot the hams and use at least 10 hammers that you loot on the Snitchel. And then you have access to the boss. You can use up to 50 hammers on the Snitchel before you get a message that says you are finished. Then head over to Thais, go to the south gate and then a bit southeast. Head inside the portal in this tent to get to the event island. Here you run to the boss room by following this path. The boss have three different phases. Step one is that you have to put the right ingredients in the pot. Right click to grab the item which the orc tells you to put in the cauldron. We usually place one person to the west and one person to the south. One to the east and one to the north if we are enough people. If we're only two people, well, we take two sides each. Repeat the ingredients until you reach the next step. Step two is to trap some elementals in beer casks. So, you open the traps, lure the elementals over them, and then force the casks to go to the northwest corner. As a measure of precaution, you have to avoid getting hit by the elementals because you will lose time and you will be kicked out sooner. After luring the kegs, now the boss will spawn. One person clicks on the bear in the southwest corner, the rest lures the boss onto the keg. Do that until you reach phase one again. The foods in stage one is always permanent and it's quite easy to learn the locations of them. You need at least two people to make this boss. Repeat the food preparation. Once the elemental spawns, well, you know the deal. Lure the casks up to the west corner. Remember that you have to open the traps to get the elementals into the kegs. Do the boss again. Use the beer barrel in the southwest corner. Lure the boss onto it. And once you've done that the second time, the chest will spawn. And you kill the chest to get the loot and, and some boss diary progress. You can access the boss again in one hour, but only three times in one day. After you faced him the third time, you have to wait 24 hours. Reward from looting the boss is some of the plushies and you get 100 festival points that can be traded for lots. Lots can contain plushies, which is pretty cool. You also get easy points by doing the whack and orc, win a race or eat a sausage. And here is how you do it. So have you tried the Orc Sober event yet? What's your favorite minigame? The minigames you can do is race, eat the sausage, whack and orc. You can also do some other events, but these are the three that I focus on. So to win the race, you need to jump, jump in with either solo or with three different people. Pick up the fork and use it on the wagon if it gets paralyzed. Sit tiles makes the wagon go haste. You should avoid dogs and slimes because they paralyze the wagon. Here you will get 15 points for each person who finished the race. You can repeat this once every 30 minutes. I also like to do whack and orc. So 
an easy way to do whack and orc is jump in, put the hammer on a hotkey, make sure to change the hotkey to use with Corsair, and press the hotkey, left click the orcs. Do not hit the kittens, you will be kicked out. Lastly, I like to do the sausage race with my friends. So you eat sausages and be happy. The one that wins gets the points. It's a fun event and you should really try it out. If you like to make money in Tibia, you should check the video on screen right now. Otherwise, until next time, see ya.